My name is Lavelle Palmer. I play for the Houston Dynamo, and you're watching Football TV. Football, 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 football. Seen, seen. I'm addicted to Lavelle Palmer. Coming to the MLS, obviously you had a, a tryout in Orlando, and uh, did you come in as a central midfielder? Were they looking for a central midfielder? Um, yeah, I know you've played on the outside right. You've played different positions, but you, you, you're very comfortable now in the central mid. Is that what they, they recruit you for? Yes, actually. Yeah. Um, I, it's funny because I used to watch um, Ricardo when he plays for New York. Okay. Uh, what's the name at the time? Uh, Metro, Stars. Metro Stars. Yes. Yeah, so I used to watch Ricardo, and then I hear, hey, you're coming here to replace this guy. <laughs> you know? I mean, I haven't played center mid in a while when yeah. I went to um, Orlando to join with the team, but I'm like, hey, I'm a professional. If this is where I'm going to get my chance to play, I'm definitely going to do my best at it, you know. So, yeah. Let's recap last season, which is your first season in the MLS. Um, How did you feel you, you did I think I individually? A, yeah, I think I had a pretty good season. You know, I um, played, what, 24 games out of 30. Mm-hmm. You know, I was available for 26. You know, I got two red cards. <laughs> <laughs> but, uh, yeah, I think I had a pretty good season. I logged a, um, quite a few minutes. Yeah, and um, score a goal that was goal of the week, was in the running for goal of the year. So yeah, I think I did good. So now in the off season, preparing for 2011, what did you tell yourself that you thought you had to work on or, you know, to, to, to be a major impact in Houston Dynamo season? Well, it's it's a professional league. We have players coming in, going out, you know, yeah. so I have to come back with making a difference. You know, I have to come back and uh, have the same impact that I had last year or even a greater one, you know, because at any time a new guy probably come in and take my place just like I came here and, and took, took some of yeah, so. And um, now you're playing central midfield, you're playing alongside Jeff. Uh, tell me about you guys' com- combination and chemistry that you guys are trying to build or have built in the central midfield. Well, um, I think we're pretty big together, you know, um, in practice, in, in the games, you know. Um, we're roommates as well uh, on the road, so we talk about our game, what we want to do. You know, I, I try to be around him as much as possible as I can, you know, because just to be that uh, bond and camaraderie. Yeah. Now, is he play more attacking? Do you guys play attack and defensive or left, right in the center mid? Well, um, I mean, we both can play either position, you know, so whichever position you get caught in whenever, you know, because the game, it's a lot of transition. So wherever you get caught, you just have to do the work. So in the second half, um, when the legs are tied, game is uh, in a tense mode, who, is it you or Jeff, who tends to get back a little bit less? Well, I think Jeff. I mean, I, I guess probably for, for me, um, I, I find myself more being that guy to, who more mobile. So you trying to say you have to scream at Jeff a little bit more to get back? <laughs> no, I, I, I don't. I, don't. Oh, okay. I leave him. <laughs> I leave him. <laughs> I, let him <laughs> I let him do whatever, you know, because I, I know whenever time he is up top, you know, he's very influential for us, you know, he can make something happen at any time. What do you think about you guys this season? Um, obviously, you have some new attacking players as a Bruin. Um, you have some new defenders as uh, Sar Cody. What do, you, what do you think about uh, these new additions and you guys, uh, what's your aspirations for this season for Houston Dynamo? Well, um, I think Will, uh, Kofi, you know, great players, young guys, um, just need to make the transition from college to the higher level, you know, it's more physical and stuff like that, you know. Um, I think first and foremost, we need to get in the playoffs and who knows, anything can happen from there, you know, so we're just concentrating and making the top 10 or being the top eight nice. for the playoffs. Now, Jamaica is going into the Gold Cup uh, this uh, this this summer and uh, obviously Jamaica with Theodore Whitmore is, is the new coach. Uh, how, do you, how do you like Theodore as a coach? I think he's a good coach. Um, he's a player's coach as well. He used to play the game. He still trains with us whenever time we, we, we play, mm-hmm. you know. Um, I think uh, our chances are pretty good. We have great players. We have players playing in the top leagues around the world. You know, so I think our chances are as good as anyone else. I appreciate your time for Footballer TV, and we wish you all the best. And look for much success from you and the Houston Dynamo, as well as Jamaica in the Summer Gold Cup, leading off to the Brazil 2014 campaign. Thanks much, man. Uh, My name is Lavelle Palmer. I play for the Houston Dynamo, and I'm a footballer. Footballer, see? <laughs> I'm addicted to you. You're my addiction. You're my addiction.